Time now for sports with Scott Green. Yeah, welcome back, everybody. Billing swimmer Ethan Harder today announced his commitment to the University of Texas. Q2's Casey Conlon shows us why it's such a big deal. For Ethan Harder, the choice was simple. They have probably the greatest swim programs ever. Like, it's insane. And then their academics are also amazing. And it's just, it's like the perfect place. It makes sense that Harder, who may go down as the best swimmer in Montana history, would choose the best swimming school in NCAA history. Four year, years in a row, NCAA champions. And like the coach who's been there, Eddie Reese, is basically every Olympic team that we take for the Olympics, he's on it. If you, know, if you want to try and work your way onto one of those teams, this coach is one of the ones that's going to you know, give you that best step. Carter started making noise as a Billings senior freshman a couple years ago. Since then, he's gotten so good that he's transitioned to homeschool to accommodate a growing list of national meets. It's a lot better because I have a lot more time to like go to like these things. It's like the national junior team camp was 10 days. And he loved every minute because he's racing the top kids. He's racing the kids who are first at nationals, first at juniors, right with them. If he's going to take that next step, get into a situation where it's just every day you're, you're challenged. That hasn't been the case in Montana, but it certainly will be at Texas, with three other top recruits joining Harder in Austin. It's maybe a lot better, because like, when I go there, I have like, everybody to race, and like, it's so much fun. It's, it's just fun to race them, too. The guy who won the 200 back is a freshman, so Ethan goes in, and he has two years with that guy, yeah. and then the guy behind him coming in in another class is also like projected to be that kind of swimmer as well. Like They're all right in the mix, so he's going to have a great training group. In the end, Harder admitted this decision was made with one goal in mind. I'm definitely going for the 2020 Olympics in Japan. This could be, it's gonna be tough, but I think I can do it. It's good that he's saying 2020. Obviously, 2020 is just gonna be the starting point, but I think 2024 is in play, 2028. As, like, he can go as far as he wants. Casey Conlon, MTN Sports. This is big time. Congratulations to Ethan Harder. His next giant event three weeks from tomorrow, swimming for the USA Junior National Team in Vancouver. We're told that this will be his first ever international meet.